hello everybody traffic on the way to chicago midway airport but we are in route your girl got 15 minutes because <laughs> i left early thank goodness but we are on our way to the airport traffic was kind of backed up i think because um there was a car accident but we are moving we are heading to the airport and i'll see you guys when i get there you guys we made it on the plane and we're actually on our 800 max series um my co-workers are all the way up front and i think we're waiting on our d because you know on the 800s we have to have four flight attendants but right now we have three so we're waiting on one more that's why we're a little delayed but it is all okay we're just getting here i'm gonna bite my meatball sandwich that i got for um from this one restaurant restaurant in the airport i'm gonna check my equipment and we are going to get it rocking and rolling <laughs> We had such a long day. One four and a half hour flight and then another three and a half hour flight. We flew from Chicago to LA and then LA to Houston. And we were so delayed. We ended up having like just a 10 hour overnight. Naturally, I wake up early, so I am up. It's um, about 9 a.m. And my lobby is one. I plan on going back to sleep. Definitely. But I'm up because my friend is actually in this hotel. And it was funny because she's on the a.m. and I'm on the p.m. So we were trying to meet up. But I was like, okay, stay up, stay up. I want to see you. She didn't stay up. She fell asleep. Uh, she texted me this morning. She's like, okay, I'll just drop by your room. So I'm like, okay, drop by my room and say hey. Kitchen was closed last night. I was like, um, Sharonda, do you have anything in your food bag? She said no. She ate all her food. So I went to bed hungry. Anyways, I am laying here. My friend better come on because I'm going to go back to sleep. She has to go to work. We both have international turns today. She's going to Aruba and I'm going to Cabo. She actually did head to Aruba and then she works a flight from Aruba to Baltimore. We work a flight to Cabo and then we work a flight to from Cabo to Sacramento. And it's like this day is just long again for no reason. But it's all good because tomorrow I only have one leg home from Sacramento and I get in early. Who is it? Hey girl, hey! <laughs> so guys, I'm all dressed ready for work. It is hot as hell in Houston. I'm actually leaving 15 minutes early so that I can um, go and get something to eat. I told the workers to, if, like I asked the workers if they could let my food know that I left early. So hopefully they do that, but I need to get something to eat because I'm starving. I want to eat before we have this flight to Cabo and then Cabo to Sacramento. So I'll see you guys when I get to the airport. So you guys, we made it to Cabo, but look, can't do anything. Can't get off the plane in Cabo because it's only a turn. So we're here, but we're leaving. And I'm sad. Goodies, we get crew meals. So I believe we have a turkey wrap. So we have turkey wrap cookies, fruit is under the sticker, and then we have chips. So I'm gonna eat this. from Cabo we went through um, customs and um, I guess we're here now you can't really see me but I'm in my hotel I just came upstairs from having um, dinner with my crew and it's so beautiful out here in Sacramento let me share with you now you guys know every time I come to Sacramento I always um, go to Old Town or downtown Sacramento but this overnight was so short I just went to the um, hotel restaurant and the honey sriracha wings were actually pretty tasty. <laughs> so my view is pretty cute. Um, my room is the same old, same old. One bed. I didn't realize I have to be at the airport as early as I do and I'm like, what the? <laughs> like, my report time is 5.55. What? I didn't know I was on AM. <laughs> Like I traded into the trip because it was two, two, one, which is two legs the first day, two legs the second day, and one leg tomorrow the last day. So I was like, okay, cool. But I didn't realize we, like I 
knew that we got back early and I was like, shit, I guess if we got back early, we had to start early. So it's fine, I guess to get home and celebrate my grandmother's 80th birthday. But I am signing out in Sacramento and I'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning. It is 5.50 a.m. I'm in Sacramento and I'm heading to the airport. I have one beautiful leg all the way home to Chicago. I'm scheduled to get in at 1.30 p.m. I'm so excited because I love getting done early. I love, love, love getting done early. So but I hate starting early, but you have to start early in order to get done early. So I'm super stoked about that. And I got like two minutes to be downstairs. So hopefully my crew doesn't leave me. But um, let me get my butt to the airport. And I'll see you guys when I get there. Sacramento is like three and a half hours, so I had to stop and get something to eat. So I got a sausage croissant, of course with no cheese, and I'm gonna add grape jelly. Because I think I'm gonna be hungry. It's gonna be about 1.30 when I land. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be hungry, so I need something to eat. What a beautiful morning in Sacramento. Dual boarding, we're here. We're doing dual boarding today, so that will be boarding in the back of the aircraft. And then we have our new little containers. This is for our coffee and creamer. And then I have a YouTube channel. Oh, and then we have the new baskets that we're gonna serve our peanuts and pretzels in. Well, peanuts and pretzels up until we stop serving peanuts. Um, so just got here and I'm going to check my equipment. If you do not meet those function criteria in the card or are unable to perform the functions or don't know what a function is, please let one of us know. We'd be happy to get you receipted. In order for us to push back to the gate, we do need everybody in a seat with your seatbelt securely fastened. Your seat backs and tray tables need to be in their full upright and locked position. And all your carry-on items either need to be up in those bins above your head or completely underneath the seat in front of you. The area around your feet must be left completely clear. Laptops and meters need to be turned off and so to sign. And if you wish to use Metro Takeoff, please don't under the seat in front of you. Thanks for your attention. Welcome aboard. At the moment, we need to point out the safety features of this Boeing 737-800. To fasten your seatbelt, slide the slide end into the buckle and to release, lift up on the buckle. Position the seatbelt, slide low, cross your hips and wear at any time you are seated. There are eight emergency exits aboard this aircraft. Remove the vest only until to do so. Pull the red strap, open the container, remove the pouch and place the vest right over your head. Wrap the black strap around your waist, buckle the front and fold it tight. Once outside, pull the red tap to inflate and to manually inflate, blow into deep at your shoulder. Flight attendants are not coming by to make sure seatbelts are fastened. Seat backs and tray tables are in their full upright and locked position and all your carry-on items are either on, underneath the seat in front of you or in those bins leaving the area around your feet clear. Smoking, including the use of electronic cigarettes, is never permitted on board this aircraft. Federal law prohibits tampering with disabling or destroying any smoke detector in an aircraft laboratory. Federal aviation regulations requires passenger compliance with a light of passenger information signs, post-up placards, and crew members. Although we never anticipate a changing cabin pressure, if one should occur, four yellow oxygen masks will drop in compartments overhead. To activate the flow of oxygen, pull down the mask until the plastic tubing is fully extended. Place the mask over your nose and mouth, breathe normally, then secure the mask with the elastic strap. 
All the walk through will be flowing on plastic guide may not completely inflate. Please continue wearing the mask until otherwise notified by a uniform crew member. If you're traveling with small children or anyone needs special assistance, just put your mask on first. Now that the videos the notes to back relax and enjoy this three and a half hour flight to Chicago. Welcome aboard. I'm all done with my one leg home to Chicago. I've made it to my grandmother's house. We are celebrating her 80th birthday. We're all meeting here first to eat cake and ice cream. And then we're going to go out for the way. Then we're gonna go out to dinner. Happy birthday, grandmother. You look so pretty. 80, you're, oh my gosh, you're 80. You're so cute. This is a nice birthday. Excuse me, you guys. Are you having a happy birthday? Yes, I am. <laughs> <It's beautiful. laughs> But uh, my schedule tomorrow changed. I was supposed to only have one flight back home to Chicago, get done at like noon. But um, they added on a Omaha turn. So I go from Chicago to Omaha and then Omaha back home to Chicago. <laughs> 